Hey guys, Barry Infos here. Welcome to another GTA San Andreas 100% walkthrough video. Today we're going to buy this asset. So, before we unlocked San Fierro, we got a garage. In order to make this garage work, we have to buy this asset as well. This asset you can buy it after you complete the driving school. All bronze. All of them have to be on bronze. All the medals have to be bronze in order to unlock it. So, shall we begin? These are optional missions, by the way. You can leave this and don't, don't buy it at all and you can finish the game but in order to get 100% completion of the game you have to buy this asset and do the four missions associated with it so this is 50,000 bucks now let's go let's start the first mission we have four missions to do and i'm gonna do them right now so let's go can i make it exactly ah no pretty close zero ink in Read them and weep, cabron! Oh, shit! <laughs> so this is it, huh? The great new business venture that's supposed to save all of our worthless lives? You wanna get in? Look, I thought this was supposed to be our foot on the ladder. I thought we were gonna make this place work. Damn, she's fast. Hey, it might look like we playing cars, but we actually planning. Don't worry, sweet baby. We're about to go get our first project. At last, it works. What works? Oh, just a simple bit of electronic wizardry and intellectual bombast that hacks into the state-of-the-art satellite immobilization technology on board our target vehicle. <laughs> what the oh, hell did he say? I don't know what he just said, but it's on. Yes, it's on. Wait, what's on? Dumbass. <laughs> this gadget is set to pick up on cell phone signals. Each time she makes a call, it will give you the new location. You have to stay close if you're going to get an updated position, though. Okay? Sure, Z. Sounds easy. For sure. Good looking, Z. Alright, so, in this mission we have to follow a girl, and she's gonna give us, give us locations. But, since I know exactly where she's gonna be, I'm just gonna intercept her directly. Okay. Oh. She was faster here than I thought. Okay, she got faster here than I thought. Usually you have to wait right there at the edge. And she's gonna come shortly afterwards and then you can uh, and intercept her easier from the first uh, corner. But this time it wasn't that case. And that's the first mission. You have to... If you know where she's gonna be exactly, you can just intercept her directly. You can now modify street racing cars this mod to shop in ocean flat the, ocean, the cars you steal from the garage business can be found in wine cars showroom so every time you complete a mission you're gonna get a new car and that car is gonna be stored right over there so let's begin with mission number two first i'm gonna go safe let's start my favorite wine cars mission it's called test drive Hey, Carl! There's two cars on the list, they say. And they're in the showroom across town. Let's go get them. <laughs> Always admire your direct approach, huh, Bray? Yeah, man. Very short cutscene. Okay, let's go get those wheels. No problem, dude. He's gonna talk during the whole trip there, so I'm gonna shut up now and let him talk. I like this place, you know? Where? San Fierro, man. My home will always be the Varios and El Corona. But this city, it has something gentle about it. Yeah, I know what you mean. Kendall seems to like it too, you know? Oh yeah, she's really getting her head into this business thing. That's good. She always been the brains of the family. She should get out together and make something of herself. I think she's aiming to make something out of all of us, eh? <laughs> yeah, she the moms of the family now. Hey, who's this truth guy, Holmes? I don't think he's wrapped too tight. He just sees everything from a different perspective, that's all. At first, I thought he was just another acid casualty fruitcake. But some of the things he say, I don't know, man. It ain't all bullshit. <laughs> hey, you gonna become an alien hunter, Holmes? <laughs> I'll take a rain check on that one. This is it, CJ. They're in the second floor showroom. What? How we gonna get him down? I agree with CJ. He's sure to sometimes right. Can I help you two, uh, gentlemen? Yeah, you can help us by going to help some other motherfucker. Y yeah, the, that sounds like a good idea. All right, CJ, it's time to roll. Let's follow the leader, you better keep up. Follow the leader. Ah, uh, you a maniac, essay? Who do you think the leader is, dude? 
It's always me. Hey, Caesar, watch this. Nitro! Whoa! <laughs> oh, I love this mission. So one thing you have to know about this mission is that every single car in this mission is scripted. Every single car, the, tra the trams, the trucks, every single vehicle. Indeed. And the cops are after us. And there's a tram, everything is scripted. This is one of the only missions where everything is scripted. I hate you for that line. I have used this line a few times during this walkthrough. I think at least, I don't know if I have. As you can see, every single piece of vehicle is scripted. Also, if you crash into some, they're gonna just take you for a ride. They're completely solid and you cannot move them. Some of them, some of them you can, but some of them you cannot. Okay, Caesar, that's enough fun. Let's get these cars back to the garage. Okay, CJ. Hey, I know a quick route. Hello, cut. Put back the game in the old time. Get out of the fucking Come on, CJ, you never have any fun. As you can see, as you saw, that vehicle was completely solid. I love this mission! It's awesome! It's a shame everything is scripted, but it makes it more fun. Can we think about getting back before I end up in a car wreck barbecue? CJ, come on man, have some fun. It's a game. It's only a game. Why you have to be mad? Yeah, yeah, chillax. Let's go, Caesar. Let's go. I'm gonna push you. Come on, bro. Let's go back to the garage, eh? Hey Caesar, watch this! Not you! No, <laughs> I cannot press it. Oh, you beat me to it. Stupid Caesar. There we go, mission passed. Awesome mission! And as a second car, 40 wine cars, showroom, think, shop. Yeah, there we go. It's gonna be inside of there. We have two more missions to go, so I'm gonna go safe and do the third mission. Mission number three for wine cars. Customs fast track. Yeah, I got it! It's in the manifold! Shit, I just changed that seal! Must have got a crimp in it, damn! Hey, C's! CJ knows his cars, man. He ain't my boy. Well, he ain't my boy, so it must be yours. Hey! We're almost living a normal life, huh? This is far from Grove Street, right? Yeah, I know, but... I just can't get it out the back of my mind. Moms, sweet, smoke, I just can't let that go. I know. So what we gonna do about sweet? See, it's a shitty situation, but I gotta let it play out a little longer, okay? Okay, but be careful. We ain't trying to lose you again. That's right, sis. Good looking out. Oh, such a touching cutscene. Oh, I wanna hug you both so much. Hey, I wanna Carl. embrace you. I got a rap to you, Holmes. Wanna rap with me? I'm the best rapper, man. You should talk to OG. I Mo. know a guy who class. knows a guy who handles freight containers down on the docks. He saw one of the containers was loading up cars, and one was a match for a car on a customer's wish list. So he marked the container with a spray can, but it might be too late. The ship's loading and it moves out tomorrow. Okay, let's go peep it out. See what we can see. Is it just me or is peep it out sound kind of childish? Let's peep it out. It seems like something a child would say. Let's peep it out. Yeah. Anyway, we have to go to the docks. How are we gonna steal a car from container ship, Holmes? You know, the same way they got on. Use a dockside crane. Man, those things are real high up. I ain't too good with ladders and I'm afraid of heights. Okay, I use the crane. You better be ready to crack the container. So here's some trivia for you guys. First of all, That's the ship, CJ. Okay, I'll go sort out the crane. Give me a second. Yeah, first of all, let me. Let's hear this. Is marked with spray paint. 
Well, we'll just have to try one at a time, eh? Okay, so let me explain some stuff. So in the beta of GTA San Andreas, we had a mission with a helicopter. The photo opportunity one, what was it called? In the... As soon as you unlock San Fierro, you get the mission. Where you have to photograph a few people. And... Not this one, CJ! And in the beta of the game, you had to drive a, a helicopter. And Caesar was in the helicopter. In the beta, from what I have heard, he said something like... I'm afraid of heights because of this mission. So, he's referencing that to here. He's afraid of heights because of that mission, which does not even exist in the game right now. It is not in the final game because apparently they didn't want you to, you know, have access to no helicopters. Luck, so early on, and since the flying school is later on, you know, it wouldn't be wise to have a helicopter so early on in the game. It's not really early on in the game, but they want you to have access to that later. So this mission is easy and it's always in the last container. So doesn't matter which one you get first, it's gonna be always in the last container. Also I suggest getting a rocket launcher before the start of this mission. I currently have one and it's the, the heat seeking launcher. Okay, that's it. Okay, CJ! This is the one! Good work, Holmes! Thank you, Holmes! And of course, we're gonna have trouble, like always. Who are these bastards? Hey! What the fuck do you think you're doing? CJ! I could do with some help! Bloop! <laughs> awesome. So there we go, last car, and this is why I want you to have the heat seeking launcher. Hey, hold it right there. I could do with a little help, CJ! He did. Okay. Stay right there, you thieving bastard. Look and plop. Let's go, so So you have to uh, keep the car in tip top shape and you're gonna get lots more money this way. If you damage it, you're gonna get less money. Sure, Holmes. I guess. But what else you qualified for? Yeah, I feel you. That brings an interesting question. Has CJ, has, has CJ actually finished high school or college? He's 23 hey, or. CJ! We get paid on the condition of the car, Holmes. Be more careful. Who's driving? Me? Shut up, dude. Hey, Holmes, that was fun. We should do that again. I agree with Caesar. CJ doesn't have fun. Doesn't want fun. I don't care about the money, so I damaged it. Okay, car exports and imports have been unlocked. Check the wanted board at the Easter Racing docks for vehicles you want for exporting. Deliver wanted vehicles to the ship. Vehicles are also imported on certain days. So yeah. You can finally start the import export crane thing. As you can see, I didn't get the max money, I got not too much. But anyway, I don't care about money. So, in the next episode, we're gonna do the import export crane. And that's it, let's move on to the last mission of Wayne Cars. Last mission for Wayne Cars. Let's begin Puncture Wounds. We have two dead guys. What you looking at, CJ? I saw that. I saw that. Was that Katie? I think that was Katie. Hey man, where you been? I tracked one of the cars on our shopping list. But the crazy bitch, she dressed like the devil. I've been following her for hours, but she stopped for nothing. You'd have to ram her off the road in order to get a chance to get her car, and you know a wrecked car is no good to us. I swear she's playing with me. She Dude, the fuck calm out. Damn. If she playing with you, then she probably won't get one time involved until it turn ugly. We gotta find a way to stop her or slow her down. That woke him up. Too bad we can't involve the police. Cause then we could pop her crazy bitch tires and bang her crazy bitch ass in jail for being a danger to my sanity. Holy shit, dude, she likes. Take a chill pill. You know what? I think I got an idea. Dude, take a chill pill. Like Jesus says, take a chill pill, brother. You gotta be like a fly on shit. A hundred eyes everywhere. <laughs> That's a quote I will never forget from Jeezy. Ah, oh, Jeezy, such a man. 
such a terrible man. So let me continue with my conversation I had before this mission. Oh, it, yeah, I ah uh, seriously, uh, I try to avoid everyone, but what happens? Uh, anyway, let me continue with my conversation. CJ, I don't think CJ has finished university. He was in high in high school with Ryder. Yes, we saw that in a cutscene. They were talking about high school. They were they are together, and since CJ is 24 years old in this game, he probably hasn't finished university, he hasn't gone to university. You have to be like 23, 24 years old in order to be to finish university and he spent the majority of his days in Liberty City, so I don't think he had the opportunity to go to university. Hey CJ, how's it going with that crazy bitch, eh? Popped her, just about to fix the tire. Should be back any minute. Okay, careful with that puncture repair shit. It's nasty stuff. Will do. Later, man. Man, stuff is disgusting. Oh shit. All over my clothes. I wonder why did they decided to make the cutscene black. They shouldn't have. I mean, you can you can just put him next to the car and Neo before next to the car, and just move his hands a little bit. That would work. But they didn't do that. Anyway, so this game has many missed opportunities. Seriously, this mission could have been a lot better. Now they could have done it so that you drive back with flat tires. That would have made this mission a lot more interesting and more exciting. But they didn't do that, so that's a missed opportunity. Another missed opportunity is, why not put these stingers in normal gameplay? I mean, you could just buy them from the garage, like let's say 1000 bucks or 10 stingers. And you could use it in normal gameplay, like in police chases, that would be great. It would add another element to the chases, that would have been better, so yeah, another missed opportunity, in my opinion. But it's okay, this is still a great game, but more things are better, man. Just add more great things. And we have acquired the asset for Wayne Cars. 8,000 bucks every single day. Oh, feels so great. So I am gonna collect these, probably, or actually, uh, in the next video, I'm actually gonna get lots of money. And that's gonna be enough for all the, the properties. So in the next mission, in the next video actually, I'm gonna go and do the export, import export grain and I'm gonna get lots and lots and lots of money, so yeah. As you can see I can export this vehicle, but that's gonna be for the, the next video. So, let me show the rewards, you get all, all the cars you saw during this video, during these missions, are in here, as you can see we have three here, and the last one is over here, and we have a bonus one, this one which was not in any single mission. But yeah guys, that's it for this video, thank you so much for watching, I have 800,000 bucks which are not enough for the properties, but in the next video I'm gonna get lots more money with the import-export cranes, so expect that in the next episode, thanks for watching and I'll see you there.